Well, hello there, YouTube, and welcome to a 39 degree Friday the 15th of April. Is it just me or is it really weird that we're halfway through the fourth month of the year? How is that even possible? It feels a lot warmer than 39 degrees. The humidity must be up or something. I don't know. I think it's supposed to be nice today. So in lieu of that, we're going to take the Acura. How much that grass has grown. Man, one week. It's that time of year, though. All right. Welcome to Friday. Put out a truck. <laughs> oh, what Chris is toting back and forth in that pro caliber trailer, but. He's doing something. Yeah. Probably delivering bikes, picking up bikes. Who knows? Yeah, there's something. People are, when do you come get my bike? <laughs> Lord have mercy. Well, Mama, yes, we have made it to. And then when you took that coat off, and I guess I didn't get a look at you. I was busy oh. driving down the road. That thing's fiancy there, Mama. Isn't it fiancy? And look, it's all soft and fluffy. Oh, wow. No wonder you were hot. Yep. You go down the road, you go, I got around my okay. coat. I had so one too her. many layers. Well, Mama, it's Friday. <laughs> Let's go bust it out. And get a weekend going down. All right, sounds good. All right. All right. We'll see you as the day goes on. Sounds like a plan. All right, love. See you. Bye. I love you. <laughs> bye bye now. Bye. I don't even, because uh, I didn't do anything with that vlog yesterday, so I'm gonna have to do a double vlog today. I think I talked about this thing. I was in the middle of, and I got to finish it up today. My schooling with with BRP. And I got some BMW stuff as well. But anyway, uh, this is the Mantis Green F3S SE or Special Series. It's where they don't, they were very proud of putting Special Series on there before. I don't see that listed, but that's cool. You know it's a Special Series. It's got the RT cluster in it. I don't want to turn the key on because it's missing components and it'll freak out. It doesn't have the uh, park brake module which is the housing hanging out of here. It's literally, I was trying to think, I think I mentioned this yesterday, I was trying to figure out where the park brake module is. Well, it's the whole park brake motor. That is the module. <laughs> and it doesn't have, uh, I think this one's missing the park brake module. Is it missing the reverse? But, oh yeah, it's not even there. Not there. The reverse of... Uh, lockout i don't have anything down here to show you there's a plate i talked about it once before you can be careful um the wires they can get some dirt in them on the f3s the newer rts have the same setup but it seems like it's rained a little bit but it's a it's a servo for a lack of better terms that turns a little shift arm and unlocks a passageway on the shift drum that allows it to take one additional click in the essentially the wrong way and that that activates a shift fork in the reverse system on it so both those rts are missing the um the reverse actuator and the park brake modules this one's missing the reverse actuator and the park brake module but these are missing the uh which i mentioned already the it's an assembly. It's an assembly. It has the windshield motor and the brackets that come up and hold the metal plate that holds the windshield. I noticed something yesterday when I was tucking that away. Yes, that is a scratch that's in it, not something on it. It's in it. And uh, this one's missing the, the keypad for the tank here. And I'm praying some Yahoo doesn't undo that zip tie because that coupler is going to go whoop, it's going to go sliding inside there and uh, i'll be taking the whole spider apart to fix it actually I, i'm sure the guy that built it will probably do the mods or maybe not and i got them tucked in here using the old floor jack trick you pat them up so that floorboards don't bang the the mufflers and uh, everything's nice and safe that silver i think i mentioned that yesterday too I'm probably repeating stuff from yesterday's walk. I didn't build it, so it's not in my head, you know. 
But that silver looks like kind of like the same silver as the 2010 RT. They had that. And it kind of became a boring color because there's so many of them. And it just never came back with that color of silver. So I seen him when he was building that thing upstairs and like this, I'm just under artificial lights. And I'm going, man, they brought that silver back out again. But this is a black edition. And he brought this thing down, had to open the doors because can't put the park brake on. There is no park brake. And uh, anyway, that thing in the sunshine. Oh, and the new, you know, body style of the new RTs is just magical. Somebody was asking me, do you still prefer the older body style? No, I never prefer. I loved them when they were out. But as of 2020, dude, game changer. All you do is ride one. Just ride one. Game over at that point. I love the wheels on this thing. This is something different. Look at the spokes on this. It's got these little extra. That's cool. Do these have that too? Yeah, it does. You just don't notice it because they... Uh, kind of polish the they kind of highlight it by polishing some of the um powder coating off of it same wheels chrome edition dark edition that that may be the color right there but i'm telling you oh that is some horrible white balance i apologize for that but uh yeah that would be a nightmare to keep clean but this somebody was asking can i show the mantis green this is the Mantis Green. It's kind of like, uh, you know, the orange that BRP uses, like this. That color is Can-Am Red. Remember the uh, lipstick on my 2016 Special Series? That drove people nuts. I would never change that just because it irritated people. <laughs> that little childish spite that you can have. I love that little lipstick on that thing. I mean, that's Can-Am Red which is very, very orange. And um, that looks very like a bright day glow green to me. That'll fit your uh, Olympic, you know, rain gear type stuff. But yeah, that's Mantis Green. Cool. I love that it comes with the shield and you have the full BRP Go thing too. So you got the maps and your phone and everything works with it so i what i don't know is where do you put your phone probably in the trunk huh yep if you guys wonder what these little clear patchy things are for um initially because people will rub their feet if you're using the pegs you can put them there to protect that oh there's actually something similar to that in the clamps for that, but uh, those are a different part number. But that's literally made so you don't rub the paint off. If you want these people that ride, toe out, heel in, your heel will, will ride on the frame. I would rather have the wear mark. That gives it that patina. That just looks like it's being ridden because that, you can see that clear. It's like the people put the clear on things to protect their front ends and stuff that ends up looking so ugly that's cool that's the cowling comes with the seat but the cowling's in there the mantis green cowling fits in there kind of cool that's the one of the um part specialist upstairs this is his father's 06 gsxr 750 Matt put some uh, rear sets on it. Motor's been all EDR'd out. It's a famous um, engine building place over in Oregon. These little things will live forever. Just make sure, which I'm sure EDR did, you gotta modify. Because <laughs> if you ride long wheelies on them, all the oil splashes at the back of the motor and uh, ends up seizing the number two big end of the rod and takes your crank and you don't uh, pay attention to the knock 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 of your uh, connecting rod it will blow a hole in the motor and you got to replace the whole motor Ooh, sorry about the sudden stop had a sneezing fit hit me very nice 
like old Suzuki's. There's a whole lot of Honda in those things. If you guys don't know the, the history, cool stuff. Got high-end wheels on there. The wheels on there probably cost more than the motorcycle did. <laughs> Mama, it was absolutely stunning all day today. Not very warm, but stunning. Oh, it's beautiful. And nothing to ride. I could have probably rode something if I conjured something, but I did testing all day oh. today. Got it done. Not super happy with my side-by-side -side and ATV score, so I think I'm going to redo that one. I got an option to redo it one time. Oh. Yep. Well, it's not like you but I don't ever mess with those things, yeah. so all these new technologies with all this stuff, you might as well be speaking Greek to me. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right, let's head on to the north of the land. Sounds good. So Kelly goes, can you stop a red owl I got? Oh, he goes, she goes, I need some bread and something. Just real quick. I think bread and eggs or something. I go, yeah, no problem. She goes, oh, forgot we're not in the CRV. My my purse and wallet's in the, in the back. She goes, can you open the gate right quick? The, the, the rear trunk thing back there. So I open it up and... And she goes, dang it. She goes, I don't have to have my bags. I said, you threw some bags underneath that little latch thing. Well, my camera bag and all that stuff. And she goes, ah, I'll just pay the eight cents a bag or whatever. I said, all right. And uh, so anyway, she, she walks off and I'm like, what's this crazy cool breeze? And there's an old diesel sitting here beside me. Ah, that dang that crazy woman. She didn't left her door open or something. I go, why do I hear why do I hear that truck so good? And I look back and I'm looking in the mirror, you know, and I, I just see the hole, the window's so big back there. I, I don't notice. And I turn around and I look and I go, <laughs> what the heck? She walked off with the with the rear hatch wide open. But you can just push the button again and it shuts off. It'll shut itself. You push it, it open, you push it hold and it'll shut down rain out there silly little gal but it was beautiful sunshiny and literally wonderful till we turned and started heading towards red apple kelly goes um i think it rained through here the roads are soaking wet now the car's getting wet now you're gonna put a wet car in the garage I have to pay attention to humidity make sure it don't get too high in there <laughs> <laughs> the heater runs enough. It's still warm enough, the heater. it uh, it, The heater by itself dehumidifies. If it don't, just turn that air conditioner in dehumidify mode. And I mean, it sucks it out of there, but quick. Don't want no fogging gauges or anything weird like that to happen. But, yeah, it was beautiful. Mama? Yes, baby. I remember screaming at the kids when they'd leave the front door open or something like that. Oh, yeah. So I'm sitting here, and this diesel that was sitting beside us when we pulled in. Here, and it's rattling along, and I'm like, where's this cool breeze coming from? So I looked over thinking maybe you didn't shut your door over there. So I looked back. You walked away with the rear hatch wide open. I pushed the button. <laughs> You might have pushed the button, but you should have looked. Oh, I'm sorry. But well, you can join my coldness. It's cold yeah, out there. Yeah, it's pour down rain. I'm oh. like, oh, well, it's a good thing it's a hatch. Oh. Damn, I have to give her a hard time when she gets I'm back sorry. up here. I'm <laughs> sorry. I kind of swore I pushed it, and I saw it start to come down, so I just walked away. It's like, why do I hear the rain in that diesel truck so well? <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah. Silly little woman. I totally All right. Let's mosey our way home. All right. Alrighty. Well, hello there, YouTube. I think we got the phone shade in our face or something. Try yeah. to do it. Try to do it in a different spot here. I'm trying to mix things up a little bit. But now the sun's coming out. Mm-hmm. Go away, son. Just for a minute. <laughs> yeah. We just need you away just for long enough to do a goodbye vlog yeah. outside. It is cold. Yeah, it's cold and windy. But at the moment, it's clear. Mm -hmm. That cloud's not looking real happy right there, but yeah, we'll get over it. <laughs> anyway, it's Friday. I didn't even put the car away. 
It was nice as it can. Let's just do a quick goodbye and then we're done for the night. I got two vlogs to build tonight. Yep, you got work, your work cut yep. out for you. Got a lot of work to do tonight, so yep, we will roll out. Alrighty. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. We really do appreciate it. We will talk to you tomorrow. Same smoke time, same smoke channel. Don't forget to give a thumbs up. And you guys have an amazing Saturday or Sunday. <laughs> I decided oh, to wear man, a vest cold. today because I thought it was going to be warmer today. It was warmer <laughs> earlier in Vancouver. Yeah. Just not right here. Yeah. And that wind is cutting like a switchblade. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Thanks in the morning. for watching. Bye-bye. Thank mm -hmm. you.